Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to do another episode with our construction building equipment. We've got all kinds of cool tools today. We've got our hard hat, our protective goggles. You got to wear these to protect your eyes. We also have our hammer. We've got pliers. We've got our open-ended wrench. It's got two sides, one and two, and this is really cool. We're going to show you what we can do with this. We've got our clamp, Black & Decker handy dandy clamp, and this puts wood together. If you've got more than one piece and you want to put it together, you have to use a clamp. We'll talk about this one too. We've got our Phillips screws. Screws are different than nails. Nails can be hammered in and have no threading. These little ridges right here are called threading. Those are what make the screw go inside the screw hole. But we have to screw it around and around to make it go down. And we'll show you how to do that too. Because it's got a Phillips head. That means it's a certain type of screwdriver. Phillips head and our flathead screwdriver. See how it's flat? That's a flathead. And this one's a Phillips. So let's get started. Okay guys, so the first tool we're going to check out is our adjustable wrench. This is such a cool tool. This adjusts and goes up and down. And you can make it adjustable so it'll fit any size screw or lug nut. So let's say you didn't have a Phillips, but you had an adjustable wrench. You can adjust it to any size that you want. Make it larger. Check that out. Right on there. See? And then we can tighten it and move it around. So, earlier we were talking about our different type of screws. Like nail screws. And this one has threading. All these little ridges are called threading. So what we do is once we have a hole that's drilled in our wood, we take the screw we put it in there and we can turn it. Now how do we turn it? We don't use our hands. We use a screwdriver. Right. And this one is a special one. Because it is a Phillips screwdriver. You put it inside those four little ridges and you turn and turn and turn. And it goes through the wood. Look at the bottom. Pretty cool, huh? And then when you want to take it out, just unscrew it. That's the really neat thing about screws, is if you don't want to put it in, you can take it right out. And once we take this out, we can take a look at the next type of nail. Check out the nail. This one doesn't have any ridges. It's all nice and straight, right? So we put it in to the hole and then we can use our hammer and watch this it's kind of loud pretty cool see it go in the wood nice and if you want to get it out hit the bottom and it comes right out that's pretty cool. Alright, so we've got our screws with the threading and then our nails. So what should we do next? Let's take a look at our wrench. The wrench has two different sizes. One is one size to fit a certain type of lug nut. And then the other side, which can be used to do the same thing. See how it fits on there? 
Look at that shape. That's an octagon. Goes right on the top and then turns and turns. See? We can loosen or tighten it up. Pretty cool. Let's check it out. Let's see what we can do with this one. So we'll get our wood again. We'll put it on top. Get our wrench. And we just tighten it. Go around and around. Pretty cool. I love wrenches. They're very handy. Okay, guys. So this will be the first video. We're going to do a couple other videos to show you some other tools. So check out our other videos. And remember to subscribe to our channel. We've got all kinds of cool videos and drawings and toy reviews. 